Websites can be an important part of the research process, but how do you know if a website is a good source of information? In this video, we will use the questions who, what, when, where, why, and how to talk about how to analyze a website for use in academic research. Who. Who is the author? What do you know or what can you find out about the author? Is the author qualified to write about this topic? If you cannot find any information about who is responsible for the content, it can be a sign that the website may not be a reliable source of information. What? What kind of evidence supports the content of the website? Are there hyperlinks, citations, footnotes? Can you verify the information presented on the website in other sources? When? When was the website published? Has it been updated? Is the information current enough for the topic? Where? Where was the information published? What do you know or what can you find out about the parent website? Is there an About Us section? Can you find an outside evaluation of the site? What is the domain of the website? .com, .net, .org, .edu? A .org or a .edu domain can be one indication of credibility, but should never be the only factor you consider. Why? Why did the author write this and why was it published on this website? Is it based on opinion or research or both? Do you detect any bias? How? How is the information presented? Is the website easy to navigate? Are there ads on the site? Can you easily tell what is content and what is an ad? Do you have to pay for any of the information? When evaluating websites for use in scholarly research, you should try to find the answers to as many of these questions as you can. A credible website may not meet all of the criteria discussed here, but it should meet most of them. If it does not, it may be a good idea to dig a bit deeper or to try and find a different source of information. Need more help? You can chat, call, or ask a librarian through the Rebecca Crown Library homepage.